Ha ha ha, hey everybody, Celestial Scott Gaming TV here, and welcome back to another episode of Clash Royale. And as you can see, I made a really, really weird deck, and this deck isn't even good, but look at how many battles it's been winning. Victory, defeat, victory, 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 defeat, victory, def oh wait, that's with my normal deck, so victory, defeat, victory, 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 defeat, victory, so that's one, two, three, four, that's five victories and two defeats. And this isn't even a good deck. It has, like, pretty much no main push other than the Hog Rider, Goblin Barrel, Ice Spirit, Mini P.E.K.K.A. Well, it's there are a lot of different main pushes, mostly consisting with the Hog Rider and the Ice Spirit. Um, and then, like, maybe throw a Musketeer in or a Spear Goblins in or a Goblin Barrel or a Mini P.E.K.K.A. But, um, uh, as you can see, 3-0, 3 one Three, two. Um, here, let's show you this battle. This guy had a miner, an ice wizard, an expo, and a rage spell, which is pretty, pretty hard deck to beat. And um, yeah, so I actually ended up three crowning him because he had nothing to defend, like the final push. So he's going to do that. So. I kind of just ignored it and zapped, like, the single goblin. I don't know why I did that. It wasn't a very smart move for me. And, um, that miner just went on to, like, almost kill, almost kill the tower. And then I, instead of waiting for the ice wizard to lock on and then putting down my mini P.E.K.K.A., I just instantly put down my mini P.E.K.K.A., which was not a very smart move. So now... Um, I put down an Ice Spirit and a Hog Rider, and then I wait for what he sends, and I zap it, just to, like, get my troops an extra shot off or two, and then, just like that, I've taken down the tower, because the Musketeer, oddly enough, locked onto the tower rather than locking onto his Mega Minion, so I'm just gonna let, her, let that Musketeer do her thing, and then I'm gonna put down a Mini P.E.K.K.A., who actually ends up taking out the Miner, which was, which I didn't think would happen. I put him down to, like, um, with the help of the tower, um, kill the ice wizard and the spear goblins, but instead, no, and I thought that guy was juking me out with the goblin barrel. I can't read the goblin bar barrel very well, but he was actually centering it, so I put my fireball down bad, and he sends in an expo, but I just push his lane anyways, even though he has an expo, and I was forgetting to defend it, and then I realized, oh shoot, I gotta defend that expo. Uh, and then I had no elixir to do anything other than zap, so I put down my mini P.E.K.K.A., and then his hog rider is just gonna take down that tower um, with the quick chip damage that comes from the expo. So he's going to spend it or send in a miner. Um, some spear goblins and a goblin barrel. So I just zapped that and then fireballed the ice wizard and the spear goblins. Um, and then he was in the lead with more damage on my crown tower and more damage on my um, right tower. For a second, I thought it was left. I was about to be so sad. That would be sad. Um, so I put my hog rider down on his base, desperate to get something done. Um, and then he puts down a hog rider, I guess, to just pressure me. And then, now, I hate when this happens. I hate when, um, you both have two towers down and it's going into overtime. So, it's, like, either three crown them or draw, because three crowns, obviously, are pretty hard to get. I try to zap, but I miss it. My mini P.E.K.K.A. goes down, kills the miner, kills the goblin, kills, or, well, kills just one goblin. I fireball that ice wizard. I use spear goblins for the mega minion while it is distracted. Um, I used my musketeer for its goblin barrel, which, uh, I didn't really have anything else to do. Um, and then my, his miner and my musketeer just start fighting to the death. Um, and then my mini P.E.K.K.A. was chasing that hog rider around until eventually the hog rider just, or until he zapped it. Or, no, he didn't zap it, I don't think. He just put down something else to distract it. And this is my big push, and he has nothing to defend it. And that was a three crown. And then I laughed because he had legendaries. Oh, well, I have legendaries too. I'm just not using them in this deck because they don't fit in this deck. 
um, uh, because they're just not cheap, like, this deck is all about being cheap. And, yeah, so, my Ice Spear is only level 4, by the way, guys, because, um, obviously, all I, the only way I can really get it now is by requesting, because I'm not in Frozen Peak anymore, kind of got rejected, and it was sad stuff. So, we're going to put down our Goblin Barrel to distract his prince. Coupled up with the mini P.E.K.K.A. to just do some good damage to it. And then proceed to kill the giant afterwards. And his giant's just going ham on the tower. Just killing it. And it really hurts. Ow. Um, but we're just counter pushing for the 3 crown I guess. I don't know why we're, um, we're going for the 3 crown with such a bad deck. Um. But we are. Okay, guys, you guys saw that. That's lag. That's, that's lag. That, that doesn't count, guys. So he throws in a rocket, um, to take down my tower. But it just barely does, leaving my tower up 53 health. Oh my. So close. Um. His main tower <coughs> is lower than his, um, right tower. Um. So we're just gonna take that down right there, um, with a hog goblin barrel, or well, I guess we're not gonna take it down, which is pretty sad, but, what you gonna do? So we're gonna zap mini P.E.K.K.A., um, and then we're gonna spear grabs, fireball, please work this time, don't lag, don't lag, don't lag, yeah! Um, so he supported his almost dead witch, and that's a mistake. I actually see it, people making that mistake a lot, um, in this arena for some reason. Um, they always support their almost dead troops, which is never a good idea because, um, I can just, like, arrow spell them or whatever, and, um, they'll die almost instantly. Okay, so this guy's coming in with a pretty big counter push. Um, luckily though, I can just mini peck it. And he has a rocket. Um, so now I'm desperate to get that, that, um, I'm desperate to get some damage done in some way. And my wish had come true, um, I guess you could say. Because I also, from the beginning of the fight, have more damage done on his tower. Now I've got too many P.E.K.K.A.s racing towards it. And he's got almost nothing that he can do about it. Um, so at this point, I consider him finished. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to fireball that because, well, why not? Um, he pulls a P.E.K.K.A., but I'm not really that afraid of his P.E.K.K.A. Because... Okay, he's going to rocket my hog, which is a very negative elixir trade. Um, I don't even think he's going to have time to, um... Okay, he's got a P.E.K.K.A. and a giant, which isn't that scary. Um, but I guess it's just going to have to end up being a tie. And there, that's our first battle with this deck. It's a tie against a P.E.K.K.A. user with level 6 rares, level 3 epics, and a lightning spell, and a rocket. Which, usually I can't win against the rocket, because the rocket is just... It needs to get nerfed, guys. It just, it needs to get nerfed. So, uh, jumping into our next battle... We're just going to start this battle off with a really cheap, but also very big push. Um, we're going to zap that. Okay, so I can already see what deck this guy is using. Um, it's an arrow bait deck. And as you can see, we're already cycled back to our spear goblins, guys. This deck is so much fun to use. Because you just, you're never, like, you're almost never down on elixir. 
and I love decks like that. So he should have a goblin barrel in it in this deck. And if he didn't, then I'd be pretty surprised. Because, um, judging from the deck that this guy's been using so far, it's an arrow bait deck. And if you don't know what an arrow bait deck is, basically it's when they use, like, minion horde and, like, skeleton army and stuff to try and make you zap or arrow it. And then they use, like, a goblin barrel or something like that, or, like, skeleton army or something just to destroy your tower. Um, so, he's got a giant bomb push coming at, at us. So we're just going to put down our mini packer to kill the bomber. And also do some good damage to the giant. Um, he's going to put down a skeleton army for our hog. Um, luckily though. Okay, he's going to Valkyrie that. It's pretty not good. Uh, my dog is losing her mind. Because um, I guess somebody's at the door or something. Um, but... Whoever was at the door is now in the house. Um, so, yeah. Now my dog should stop, like, barking. Um, so I'm sorry about that. Where are you? And I'm so sorry. Alright, Ice Spirit, kill all those skeletons. Eh, not all of them, but close enough. Um, okay. Alright, kill that Valkyrie before it kills you, and then Hog Goblins. Oh, 666 health on the tower! Oh god, that's, that's, that's kind of scary, actually. I don't know why I found that amusing. But, guys... Leave a like for 666 health on the tower. It's scary, but it's true. It's true. Alright, dude. Defend that. I dare you. Dang it. He just fireballs it. Alright, this guy's level 7. I can't lose to this guy. I can't. That would just be so embarrassing. Where are you? And I'm so sorry. Alright, oh, yes. Kill it. You watch me whip. Watch me nae nae. Oh, dude, you forgot I had a fireball. Brett. Alright, so that's a, that's a win with this deck. Um, and now we're just gonna laugh, because I do that. Um, as you can see from how fast I was doing it, I'm pretty good at it. I've been practicing since, like, I think I've been laughing at people since Arena 4 or 3. 3 or 4. I can't remember, but... Whoa. Dude, broken matchmaking. You guys saw my trophies. It was at like two. It wasn't even. This guy has more over a hundred trophies more than me. Guys, broken matchmaking. Supercell, fix it, confirmed. Broken matchmaking confirmed. Hashtag fix it, supercell. Um, hashtag it sucks to have broken matchmaking. Um, hashtag he almost killed my musketeer with his prince. Hashtag spear goblins on the tower. Hashtag I better stop saying hashtag before everyone gets annoyed. And now for the hashtag valued fireball. I gotta stop saying hashtag before you guys just like die. Oh, come on. Hashtag rude. Hashtag super rude. Hashtag, where are you, Darude? Come on, Mini Pecky, you can do it! Yeah, alright. That was pretty good. Um, he's in the lead. Um, but that's fine. Okay, so he's at my goblins. Which is pretty upsetting. Um... But now, we got a hog on his tower, and he's not going to be able to do anything.
thing about it. Awesome, guys. That's just what we want with this deck. They can't do anything against the small troops. Because small troops are just so OP. Guys, if you guys don't believe in small troops, then start using this deck. I promise your entire mind will change. Um, unless you're in, like, Arena 9, because you probably can't win any battles in that arena. But let's throw a Goblin Barrel, just strewn about. Okay, so he he knows that I keep on trying to juke him. Alright, well, at least that took down his pump. I'd say that's fairly successful. No! Oh god, my voice is going. And, uh, it's just it's all sad and stuff. Um, where are you? Because I'm so sorry. Um... You watch me whip. Watch me nay nay. Watch me whip. Whip. Watch me nay nays. Oh, come on, kill it. No, okay. Okay, it's gonna get three crowned. Um, sorry about the bad. Bad, um. Big darkness and stuff. Uh, but yeah, we just got three crowned, and, uh, see you guys. In <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I can't end it here. Dude, this guy's crying. I'm muting him. I can't, I can't live on with a guy that cries. <gasps> Dude, that, this guy is so good. God damn it. Watch, he's gonna laugh. Wait, or he's gonna cry. Yeah, he's laughing. Alright. Wow, only 19 trophies lost. That's pretty good. But as you can see, my battery's low and it just ruined that entire video. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, if you liked it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.